today's adventures. Um, one, it's cold, real cold. Two, lots of snow. Three, we are driving to St. Paul to paint owls. The Geek Squad truck is being towed. <laughs> I love it. Oh, uh, there it goes in the background. Okay. Um, we're driving to St. Paul to um, one of the breweries there. It's an all gluten free brewery. And um, we are going to paint owls, like pictures, not actual owls, pictures of owls um, with acrylic paint. And I, I don't know if there's like any more direction than that they're giving us than that, or they're just gonna be like, here's a bunch of paint and a picture of an owl. Go for it. Um, so I guess we'll find out. So, um, welcome to Saint Paul. Uh, this is the brewery, I guess. There's their sign. Um, I've never been here before. We keep talking about going, but we've never actually done it. Um, but here's a, like the weird, one of many weird back alley parts of St. Paul where you're in a residential district and then all of a sudden there's houses and then like you come into like commercial. So their zoning is super weird. Uh, but here we are, we're like pretty early, so. I don't know, but, uh, just, you know, this is stimulating viewing, I'm sure. It's like a truly thrilling part of the city. All right, more later, I'm sure. All right, so we have this one. They have a ton of beer. It's got a fabulous menu, but um, since I don't really drink because of the, I, I just don't, um, have, I can't metabolize the sugar very well. Um, so it's also, it's loud in here, but again, if you can't understand me, there'll be subtitles. So please turn them on. Um, anyway, this is a cranberry sour and it's got the small size. Um, and it's got, it's lovely. It's like fruity and cranberry and it's got like that kind of bitterness, but it's like a cranberry, almost more of a cranberry bitterness, and then like the sour. I really like sour things, and so this is um, great for me. Also, um, here's our little room where we're going to be painting, and like the beer things are in there. It's a whole brewery, and I guess we're going to sit here and paint some models on canvases, and we'll see what else happens. To art. Um, also loud because of, you know, beer equipment and refrigerators, but, uh, I'm gonna art today. We'll see. I'm not super good at art. I am super good at coloring, but there's nothing on this canvas and I'm really bad at drawing lines. So I'm a little concerned about that. Uh, <laughs> I guess we'll see how it goes. Um, so yeah. Here we go. It's the nicest sunset I've ever painted. I feel like it might need more pink in the mid-tone, so I'm gonna add more pink before I start making a tree. Jonas did this. It's very moody. Jenna says it looks like an oak savanna sunset, and, he, and that's not a lie. Um, so, I think that's pretty cool. What do you have? I got, you know. Why is the bottom of the tree blue? Because it wants to be? Yeah, because it wants to be, and I didn't think that would stand out against the black and the purple. Well, it doesn't have to stand out. It can just be blue because it wants to. No. But, like, mine doesn't stand out. See? Yeah. Three. That's fine. With some pot, with some buds. We have some food. I ate all of mine. Well, I didn't eat all of mine. I have sweet potato fries left, but I had an amazing cold pork sandwich. I'm about to finish my fries. Cool. So, I'm waiting for this to dry. That's what's up. I personally think it was better before I put this, like, 
kind of janky owl on it, but here's the finished product. Um, I'm super good at like large scale landscape stuff and trees and things, but then you add detail or like nuanced shapes like an owl and uh, anyway, that's the finished product. This owl's kind of janky, but it is what it is. I signed it. There it is. So um, that's official. That's what we've made. Are you done? No? Yeah, I gotta fix that. Talk us through it. Uh, Alright, so we got the, the non binary flag in the background. I felt like doing a two colored tree, so it was. And then I was just looking for something that would stand out, so I kind of went with this lighter green and the gray. It is also a nod to agender, I guess. Yeah. I didn't think of that at the time. It is. So that works out well. And then we know an owl. Yeah. Well, we know art of an owl that wears glasses, so I kind of went with that there. Um, this is eventually going to be a beak, hopefully. Uh, <laughs> it's we'll beak like. It's beak like. But yeah, so this is my glasses wearing owl, yeah. who can be whatever it wants to be. I like it. Yeah.